Hi, this is Renee from iteachblogging.com, and in this quick video, I'm going to show you how to add an alt title to your image inside of WordPress. So what you're going to want to do is open up your WordPress blog, open up a blog post that has an image in it, or a page, this would work on a page as well, and then once you have that, like you can see right here, you just click on the image, and then you click on the little pencil that says edit. Now I will say, sometimes um, WordPress will do an update and it'll change this little icon, but if you click on the image and then find the little icon, it, it'll work just fine, so there you go. So you click on that, and then right here, you click on alternative text. Now this text is important. This text actually gives um, Google a little bit of a clue about what this image is about and what this post is about. So you really wanna be wise what you're putting in here. You wanna make it relevant to your blog post, okay? So as you can see here, I was talking about cleaning up your WordPress theme. Um, I was trying to be a little clever with the closet, and so I put WordPress theme optimization. So once you put that in there, you don't have to put dashes in here, by the way. You just put your, your, your words. You click on update, and then you can update your post. Now you will not see this um, on, your, on your blog. So like if you did the title tag, like in the previous video, you'll see a little pop-up if you're using your mouse, but you won't see the alt title pop-up. Um, that's just there for Google and for alert if the image didn't show up, okay? So that is it. It's a really simple thing to do, but it's extremely important. I highly recommend that you do this for all of your images. As a matter of fact, if you haven't been doing this, you might wanna create a schedule for yourself and go back and start adding maybe five a day to five different blog posts or whatever and adding this alt title. This is very, very helpful uh, to help your, your blog post get ranked. So make sure you're doing that. It's just that little clue and all those little clues add up into one big giant clue for Google. So I hope that this has helped. If you have any other questions about WordPress or blogging, always let me know in the comments below. And until then, blog on.